at Numerian Capital, we bring you the latest stock news each day. Please like and subscribe so we can bring these articles to you each day. Thank you. Today, July 17, 2023, Sophie stock sell off, big investors jump ship. Should you? Take it slow and steady in 2023 second half with Sophie stock. A number of financial whales divested Sophie Technologies stock. However, Sophie Technologies will benefit from the resumption of student loan repayments. Investors might consider a moderately sized position in Sophie stock. A handful of large scale financial traders reduced or eliminated their positions in Sophie Technologies, NASDAQ Sophie, stock. Should this be a deal breaker for prospective investors? Not necessarily, as a high court ruling could have a major, positive impact on Sophie Technologies and its stakeholders. It's been fascinating to watch the market dislike Sophie Technologies for a while, and then suddenly favor the company. Stock traders can overreact sometimes, sending shares too low or too high. Sensible investors can avoid these traps by simply focusing on the facts. They can avoid disaster by keeping any share positions in Sophie Technologies down to a reasonable size. Why did some big investors dump Sophie stock? Not long ago, Investor Place contributor Larry Raymer identified three bank stocks that have big investors running for the exits. It's worthwhile to note large-scale share purchases and sales, so let's see who divested shares of Sophie Technologies. As Raymer reported, some of the big investors that sold Sophie stock include Virginia Retirement Systems which sold 29,300 shares, George Soros's hedge fund Soros Fund Management 1.25 million shares and investment bank Jeffries 91,644 shares. Other sellers include billionaire investor Ken Griffin 13.9 million shares and Stephen Cohen's hedge fund Pond 72 3.9 million shares. There's no way to know for certain why they unloaded so many shares of Sophie Technologies. Remember, it's entirely possible that they were just taking profits. After all, Sophie stock doubled in price from the beginning of 2023 to mid-June. Maybe some of those financial whales know something that most amateur traders don't. So, it's not a terrible idea to maintain a small position size in Sophie Technologies shares, if you choose to have one at all. A major catalyst is coming for Sophie Technologies. Even if some big shareholders dump Sophie stock, it still deserves a B grade for several reasons. Sophie Technologies has demonstrated outstanding revenue growth. It's also encouraging to see the company getting closer to profitability. Furthermore, there's a huge catalyst coming for Sophie Technologies. Per Barron's, the U.S. Department of Education announced that the first required federal student loan repayments will be due starting in October. Not only that, but interest on those loans will begin accruing earlier than that, on September 1st. Additionally, the Supreme Court rejected the Biden administration's initiative to potentially forgive, waive millions of federal student loans. Sophie Technologies generates some of its revenue from helping students refinance their loans. Therefore, a deluge of financially strapped borrowers could soon appeal to Sophie Technologies for help. Sophie stock may deserve a small investment. Clearly, Sophie Technologies will benefit from recent developments pertaining to federal student loan repayments. Also, the company appears to be improving its top and bottom line results. On the other hand, we can only speculate about why some big investors sold their Sophie Technologies shares. All in all, Sophie stock gets a B rating and might earn an A grade later this year, so financial traders can choose to start a small share position with the option of building it later on. Thanks for watching. Numerian Capital News. Please come back tomorrow for another stock news update. Thank you.